Hello, this is Trump with Trump tells the truth. I'm going to have a little view on the European Union election that was held these days, and the far right did a very, very fucking good election. Yeah, people who want to destroy the European Union, support Putin, and throw out all immigrants did a very good election. We always listen to the far right when they say, like, you're blaming everything on this and blaming everything on that, but when it comes to the blame game, nothing is harder than the far right. They want free market, totally free, with no interruption by the government or any state. But when that goes to hell, they blame the government and everybody who is another color and another religion. Destroying the European Union and to have more border control inside the European Union and so on will not work. You see what that did to Britain when they throw, when they came out of the European Union? Yeah, things go shit show, but the far right. Is always because the good shit show means they haven't done it enough. Or every time they do politics who don't work, they always blame like, yeah, but we didn't go far enough. That's why it didn't work. We didn't get finished. Yes, you've been finished. You've done a lot of things finished and destroyed. That's why people have to clean up after you. The European Union election is going to be funny. Far right Germans won, a far right French won, and far right people, Dutch people won. That's going to be a hell of a fucking shit show. But everybody, them agreeing about one thing, they hate Muslims. When they come to anything else, yes, they have to be the biggest dick in the room, have most power, and so on, and so on, and so on. They haven't learned a fucking shit. But everybody is fighting against each other. Putin is threatening the rest of Europe. But the French nationalistic leader got money from Putin. So, she, of course, she support him. It's going to be a fucking shit show. We have two more elections coming up. Well, we have one in Britain, and now one in France. Next year, we have in Norway. Yeah. And then, maybe also here, the far right will win. Climate change is happening, people are dying in fucking heat, the poor are melting, but we care about nationalism, bullshit, and going back to the past, finding solutions where there no, have only been problems. Nothing's gonna be better. A lot of people, people from the far right always say, like, yeah, the only way is racism, is because there's too many immigrants here. Well, that's very funny, because the far right was also big in the 30s. There were not many, many immigrants then, in that level. There were not many black people living in the European, in cities, but racism still was. There were nearly no Jews in Norway, but anti-Semitism was there because they blamed Jews for everything. Those 2,000 Jews who live there. That is the fucking truth. The far right is going to do the blame game. They're going to keep on continue doing the blame game because the far left proven that they cannot stand up to anything anymore. Even when they have the support, the will of the people and anything. They cannot get around something simple. They cannot accept anything. They cannot fight anything. They are fucking weakened by their own stupidity. We have to live through this shit. I hope it doesn't go too fucked up, but I'm not an optimist. The European Union election, well, didn't go the way I hoped. But there were some good results. The Green Party did well in Sweden and so on, but it's not fucking good enough. The far right, must be fought. The multinational companies must be fought. Tax havens must be destroyed. And the fascists must fucking die and rot in hell. This was Trump, but Trump tells the truth.